Welcome to the Morning Wire for Tuesday, March 16th. I'm Amanda Powell. Pay by the day is buying Grail Semiconductor. They've entered a non-binding letter of intent to inquire all of the assets along with Grail's exclusive rights to a number of cutting edge, independent and innovative technologies that combine cutting edge science and natural medicine. However, these acquisitions are subject to due diligence. Pay by the day trades on the bulletin boards as PBDH. Cyber Defender Corporation announces strong fourth quarter results. The provider of award-winning PC security software says their growth in GAAP revenue jumped an outstanding 205% to $7.5 million. They made $2.5 million in the same quarter of 2008. Gross sales grew by 128%. Cyber Defender trades as CYDE. Urban Barn Foods is rolling in the dough. 250,000 units were sold at 80 cents a piece to complete the deal worth $200,000. Unit consists of one of each common share in the company and one non-transferable warrant to purchase one common share. Each warrant allows the holder to purchase another share at $1.08 within the first year of closing and $1.20 in the second year. Urban Barn's food is on the bulletin boards as URBF. Zevo Tech has announced a massive order for its ionic bulb. We recently told you about the ionic bulb. It cleans the air while brightening your room. Zevo Tech is now working on filing a $100,000 order for 15 watt bulbs. The buyer is based in New Delhi, India, and plans to market and sell ionic bulbs in India. Zevo Tech trades as ZVTK.OV. Manhattan Pharmaceuticals is growing. The company just completed a merger with Ariston Pharmaceuticals. Manhattan issued more than 7 million shares of its common stock to Ariston, stockholders and debt holders upon the closing. Manhattan could issue up to another 24 million shares upon completion of certain development milestones. They're on the bulletin boards under MHAN. And that's The Morning Wire. We'll continue bringing you the latest small cap news all day long on publicwire.com.